Hi everyone, it is Amelia from Amelia Cells. I know it's kind of late. We just got home from the Goodwill bins. I'm exhausted. I'm kind of grumpy, but I wanted to get the haul done before I could start working on it tomorrow, and I wouldn't have to worry about it. Um, so, so everything's just mixed together. Our personal stuff that we got, clothes, hard goods, it's all mixed together. So, the first thing my husband got was this game. We got Sorry Card Avenger Electronic. Never heard a red pawn talk before? And it oh, talks. This is old. It scared me when I because I know it talks. And I heard it in the bag. Okay, next thing I got was some. Um, oh, and my Goodwill bins is about an hour and a half away from us. And it's um, 99 cents a pound. Yeah. So I got these Celebrating Ride Co. Um, ornaments. They're not like super fancy ones or anything. But I think I get like, I don't know, 15 may maybe, maybe $12.99 for them. We'll see. Trying to put stuff out of the way that's breakable. There we go. Hopefully, everybody had a good Saturday. Next thing I got was Snoopy. He's a Build a Bear. He does have some wear right here, but on his little jacket. But he's really cute. Um, yeah, he's cute. See him? Plush, the Peanuts movie, build bear adorable, and he has a little hat on, his little glasses. I got this Fisher Plot Price, or not Fisher Price, why did I think that? Flashlight Friends, little dinosaur with the light, I have no clue if it works, hopefully it does. Or if the battery packs in any good shape or not. I'm trying to see if there's a way to turn it on. I don't know. I don't know how you turn it on. Surely it just doesn't stay on all the time. I don't know. Hi, Christy. I have no clue. So I went to the bins, if you didn't hear that part. I just got home. I thought I'd do the haul real quick. Before I can work on the stuff tomorrow, maybe. Um, I'm pretty exhausted, though. <laughs> I was only there for about three, four hours, but... I don't know, I'm just tired. I got this really cool hat. Look at the feathers. Um, Scala Classics. Really nice feeling. It's, I mean, it's wool, so a little bit of wear, but not bad. Hi, Barb. How are you? I got a, that my husband found this. I thought it looked cool. Uh, vintage uh, 1994 World NBA Champion Seattle Supersonic hat. It's just cool. It's a Logo 7 hat. Just awesome. It needs cleaning though. It's kind of icky. Oh, let's see. The clothing. I got this kind of creepy looking ring and tang. I think this one will go for a bit. It has. I don't. Hopefully, it works. I didn't test and didn't think I need batteries. Uh, oh no, I should have looked though. Damn it. It is missing the door to the battery compartment. But I will still see if it works. If it doesn't, that's okay. Hmm. I should have checked that. But I didn't. Because I was like half. I was just like. What happened is when I woke up this morning, I had a headache, and I still have it. So I was working on a headache today, but he's really creepy. <laughs> if he's not worth anything, he'll be a cool... I have, like, a cage thing outside. I'll put him in for Halloween or something. <laughs> he's kind of creepy looking, I think. He'd be cool Halloween decor. 
since he's so orange. We'll see. I found another Tervis. I'm like obsessed with Tervises. You guys know that. That's for me. It says it has an S on it. It's a Tervis. Um, I found this and I wasn't going to like resell it, but it was like totally, there was a lot of, um, not worth much. So I went to throw it back and then my husband grabbed it because he wanted it. So, <laughs> there we go with that. This is just some games that my husband got. I can go through all of them. Um, my husband got some shoes. Slippers for himself. Sorry, it's all mixed. It's all mixed. Oh my gosh. We did find this, which we'll probably keep if it, it is worth a bit of money. So it's something for um, some kind of game thing. I don't know. I'll have to look it up. Maybe this will be a what the heck Wednesday item. I'm not sure what it is. And I got this for me. Uh, kind of. I got. I have a collection of pogs. And I found a book of pogs. So I grabbed them. They're nothing too fancy. Um, yeah. They don't have any like really cool one. Or any cool slammers. But I love pogs. So I found another one of these. I found one of these the other day. So it has this box. Really nice shape. Different brand though. It says it's a original cookie and noodle maker. So Guess this one you can make noodles with too. Crap. It's just like a press. Okay. I'm running out of room. So how's everybody's Saturday going? You guys having sales? Having any fun stuff going on? Trying to play this game in here. Turn it. Get the stuff out that I got. Yeah, these are just Xbox games my husband got. And we don't have an Xbox that works right now. So what? Yeah. His plan, I think he's like building his game games up for when he gets an Xbox. So yeah, that's all this is. This is a game. Yeah, it's just game. Okay. Then I got these two head-to-head -head games. Uh, vintage I didn't realize this. They're missing the battery cover. That was like the growing theme tonight. I didn't realize it till after I was getting ready to check out. I'm like, you know what? I think they're worth enough that I can just pair them together and still get what what I want for them if they work. They're really lightweight. We'll see. If not, like I said, they're really lightweight. They didn't have a lot of good hard goods tonight. Like, it was really kind of trashy stuff. Like, I feel like they were doing a lot of dump, um, dumping of bins. Like, um, the old bins. So, this is a Franklin Computer Spellmaster. I have one of these listed. I have I've sold a, one or two of them. I'm just it'll be easy to list and it works. So that one I was able to test. Okay, this is like a, I think it's a Paddington Bear, Eden Bear, 
I actually, if he's not worth anything, I don't think he is worth anything. I got him for my dog, actually. <laughs> oh, you have one sale? That's cool. What did you sell? So I got this. These have marks on them quite a bit. But I think I can maybe get this one out and lot them together. Look at that marker mark. That one's horrible. These are itty bitty American Girl Babies dolls. So, I think a lot of them together, if I can clean them up a little bit for maybe 30 to 40. So, yeah. This was also a toy that I got for my dogs. And I also got this brush to clean sh shoes with because it's a nice soft brush. Creepy dolls, you know, exactly, Christy. And then I found this doll. She's like a, she is like undressed, but she is like a, I don't think she's a Bratz, but she's made by the same company as Bratz. I got this camera. It's like a conference camera for like, um, office conferences and stuff. Hi, Rebecca. Um, I'm not sure if it works. I don't know if I can test it or not. I might have a cable to hook it up to test it. But it looked like it was in good shape. And they go for about 25 to 40 So, we'll see. Like I said, it was the hard goods were pretty slumpy. <laughs> I got some a few good ones and then I think I was just gonna run these filler stuff. Stuff all fell out. I'm gonna have to try to grab some smaller stuff. So I got a ring sizer. So I thought that was a good find. Um for me, this is for me to use just to to have one. It weighed like nothing. Let's check my All this the rest of this bag cords for video games my husband got. So we don't need to see those. Okay, so I got a travel scrabble. Um, all the pieces are there. It's in pretty good shape. I don't know if it's worth anything. If not, I'll just keep it. Or like when we go camping. I got an eye clicker too. This should sell for about $18 to $20. I have sold these before. Um, I'll have to test it. But they're like um, remotes that students use in the classroom to answer questions that the instructors, instructors ask. I got a pattern for my Etsy store. Because I have, not that I don't have enough patterns, but. Okay, and then I got um, all these little bits and bobs. Um, they're, I can remember, they're um, if I can talk, sewing machine attachments. And there's probably a few more in the bag, because I know I have another face plate. So, like, this is what this is. Um, I'm not sure the brand of them. I haven't looked, to tell you the truth. Um, I don't think they're singer. They don't say anything. They might be unbranded, and that's fine. I'll just list them. I have sewing machine accessories. Or foot. So, I always pick those up when I find them. They don't sell for a whole lot, but they sell for enough. For me to pick them up. Clear some of my clutter. Okay, I got a calculator. These go for about only about 15, but for how light it is, I thought, why not? <laughs> and it worked. So it's like a business calculator. And then I got 
um, Hulk 80, 1984 little figurine. Some of them go for like 20, some go for like 5. He's pretty dingy, so I'll have to clean him up and see what I can get. I might just be one of those things I just list it and hope, you know? Okay, I'm going to move some of the stuff or I don't knock any of it over. I have a feeling I'm going to knock some of it over. My husband got a walk. That's what's in here. Yep, how cold one. Okay, I think the rest is closed, so. Yay! What is the cat wanting? My cat? She's in heat. <laughs> That's what's wrong with her. She's going to get fixed very soon. <laughs> Afterwards. Okay. This is Lainey. Lainey, new with tags. I don't know if it's worth anything. I got it because it was new with tags. Oh no, she's in labor. Hopefully she do, she'll be okay. Or she's doing okay. Now lots of kittens. Or not a lot of kittens. <laughs> what, you, what you're wanting. Um, so it's like a poncho thing. It's really cute, I thought, for being new with tagging and everything. I don't think it's, like, worth that much. Probably, like, 30. Thank you, honey. My husband brought me coffee. Like, originally, like, 30 or 40, but I don't care. I was just trying to get stuff because, like I said, I was having a kind of a heck of a time. And I don't like coming home with no stuff. This one I got because I thought it was a sign. Had a boutique tag said Amelia's, Amelia's on it. Just a mystic top. Really cute. Flowery sleeves. Nice shape. Oh, no kittens yet. Yes, that's what I'm hoping, Christy, is that it helps my headache. Just a nice Nike shirt, black. It felt really nice, like really not worn hardly at all. So I got it. Never heard of Red Paw talk before? Oh my gosh, that thing's going to keep going off if I don't move it. Okay. Now I did get some Lou row leggings because they looked pretty and they were nice filling. So they have a pretty design. We'll see. If not, I'll just keep them. Okay, then I got mm, probably pronounce this wrong. Marika Tech. It's just like a workout shirt. Maybe like 10 bucks, 15 bucks. We'll see. It's so lightweight. It's in really good shape. Maybe even, I don't know. I didn't comp too much of this, to tell you the truth. I looked some of them up to just make sure I wanted to get them or not. This is just a London Fog sweater. And I just like the design of it. It's really pretty. I liked it. I think it's a men's. Now, I have tried to sell London Fog before, and I haven't had the greatest luck, but it was just so nice. Couldn't pass it up. And if any of this isn't worth that much, I'll just put it in my... I have, like, a section that I do, like, 3, 4, 20, or 3, 4, whatever. You know, like, I have it marked a certain way. 
in my posh closet. So I got these pink yoga. The only downside is they didn't have pink written really clearly. It just says love pink on it. But they are actual pink yoga. Um, they're in pretty good condition, though. They have a cute band. It's like gray and white lace. It looks like lace. It's made to look like lace. <laughs> I got this. I don't know if it's worth anything. If it's not, I will keep it. So I didn't even comp it because I don't want to. It's Alan Jackson t-shirt. It's in really good shape. I like it a lot. I might just keep it um, because I like it. But if it's worth something, I will sell it because I don't know. Sorry, I'm kind of grumpy tonight, guys. I'm like, rah, 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 rah. So here's a cash mink. Um scarf. It's like a hundred percent acrylic hand acrylic. But it's really soft. We looked them up and they were like anywhere from ten to twenty-five, I think. I I like ten to some and above, but maybe like one was, there are some really high ones, but I don't know if they were the, exactly the same brand. Like I said, it's really soft. So we'll see. Can't imagine it being worth as much as some of them were listed for because it's just acrylic. I don't know. Weighed nothing, though. This was cute. I got this. I got some stuff because it was just cute. I thought this is Vicky Wayne. It's Wayne's. And it's just a cute, thin, long sleeve polka dot gray dress. It's really, really cute. And really soft fabric. Got a soft surrounding white shirt. Hopefully there's no stains. I, we looked it over, but it seems like white. There's always stains on it. This is inside out. <laughs> So. Oh my goodness, Robbie. And really, if I saw shorts, I basically grabbed them no matter what. Because I have, like, found no shorts around here at all. None. So, this is just Banana Republic. A cute little white, black print shorts. Um, and, you know, they probably... Shorts don't go for that much, but it is factory. Um, they're good add-on items, I think. They will be. Hi, Joanna. Gosh, I can't believe there's so many people up this late. Ooh, I like this one. It's blue tassel. I could not find the brand, but look how long it is. It's a shirt. And I know it's not like completely lagging look, but it has the feel, like just the kind of look of it. I won't ease that, but that's what it reminded me of. Uh, so I got it. Really, I really like this. It is a size, it's huge. It's a size XL though, but that's big. Over, definitely oversized. Yes, I got, and then I got this. I got just because it's a lightweight summer dress. Cedar Tree could not find the brand as well. It's blue, white stripe, kind of. Blue, white stripe, red, white stripe, always, well, blue especially, always remind me of, like, nautical. And it's just a, I think it's, yeah, it's just like a maxi dress, I think. It might be a midi, I don't know, I'll have to measure it. But it has a cute racerback lace detail. <laughs> okay, this isn't, like, any navy, okay. Any like great brand? 
and I know that when I picked it up, but man, it's cute. It's just Marisa's, but it's a one, but it is, and it's, a, it's like a sweater pullover jacket thing. It is so cute. I love it. It has like distressed, cuffed thing and then the pattern on it is just cute and this does unzip if you wanted it to be like like that I like this hi dab kitty sparkle so this is just like I said Maurice's but it's cute so I grabbed it Okay, this is Ralph Lauren. Lauren Ralph Lauren. Uh, hey, hey, hey. Okay, okay. Hey. Hey, Donovan. Kim she wants to play. <laughs> go, go play. You. Okay. Yeah, my talk. He's like, play. Lauren Ralph Lauren. So it's really long. Blue. Long sleeve button up. And it has that. Really long. That print on it. I don't remember what it's called. It's like gingham maybe. But. Blue and white. Really cute. Oh, this is, this shirt's for my husband. It's just a button up. Short sleeve. I don't remember getting this shirt. Oh, this is at the end. I just kind of this You know when you're there so long and you're just kind of like throwing stuff in your cart sometimes. Yeah, that was this. Okay. So it's a cold it's cold shoulder, right? Kind of, sort of, not really. It has straps, off shoulder. I mean, it is, but they're just spaghetti straps. I thought it was the cute festival season shirt. It's just an Angie shirt. But it's cute print. <clears throat> cute. How many times can I say cute? This is an express uh, black and white stripe. I like stripe. I don't know why. I don't think I should be picking up this much stripes up. But it is a high, high in the front, really long, yeah, long in the back type of dress. Ooh, I really like this dress because it's fun. Oh, your cat will try to look her off by the squeaky noise. Yes, we have dogs and cats. They both play with the squeakers here. But that was the dog. So I like this because it's pretty. It was pretty and sparkly, and I thought somebody would love it. Look at it. And then it has this really fun arm. Hang. Is it in style? Probably not. Do I care? No. It's leopard print though. Sparkle leopard print. It's so pretty, though. And it's like probably like some fast, fast fashion city triangles brand. But you know what? Some cute ladies gonna be wearing this for New Year's Eve or something next year. Okay. Now, this is, I think, isn't a new day Target? I think it is. I bought take some sweaters, too. Like, summer, and I'm picking sweaters up. But you know what? I, I did. I did it. I just liked the colors. It had, like, that. It reminds me of that. Those guitars uh, and camera, like, um, shoulder straps. <laughs> the printed. 
It's in good shape. This little sweater. I'm sorry to hear that, Joanna. Okay, this is another high low, high in the front, low in the back, or long in the back. I can figure out how it goes. This is just a, I think it's Target, maybe? Morona? Is that Target broom? But it's like a tie dye print. Like, like, it's, I don't think it, it's not. It's like a dyed print. And, man, I cannot show dresses worth the hoot, guys. It's green, white, high in the front, low in the back. Very cute dress. There was these girls that were looking at it and they were like, oh my god, this is so ugly. So I grabbed it. <laughs> I thought it was cute. So this is just... Gloria Vanderbilt all around slimming effect. And I probably wouldn't have got these, but they were new with tags. And they still had the receipt in the pocket, even. So, yeah, they're new with tags. We'll see. They're capris. We'll see. They even have the sticker on the back. If they'll, they're tins. Yeah, if they'll do anything or not. I haven't had much luck with her around, but being new with tags, we'll, like I said, see. I might put some of this stuff on eBay on auction and just get it out kind of lower price. I feel like every time I go to the bins, I come home thinking like, why the hell heck did I get this? Like, <laughs> what was I thinking? Anybody else feel that way? Get like bin tunnel vision. Okay, this one was, or is, was, We the Free. Um, large, I think. Large, I don't know. It's like a thinner, kind of like gauzy feeling, almost. Black, long sleeve shirt. Has some fun sleeve details. It's a 59. Yeah, it is, right? But I know I'll be able to make my money back on with, like, the eye clicker and the two dolls, probably. We spent quite a bit. Like, we spent, like, $63, but we got a lot of, like, we got a $5 chair and, like, my husband's stuff. This stuff pretty, was pretty heavy. I'll have to figure it out how much I actually spent. Um, yeah, we got a, a two-seater camping chair, like fold-out camping chair. And at our bins, if it's over five pounds, it's five bucks usually. So, it, this was nice. So it feels really nice, soft, really soft. Okay, these are just mm, mossy mo, but they're over. They're short dolls. Is that what they're called? overall shorts and I grab them I think they'll sell they're small I really do I think they'll sell even being a target brand they're cute and they're I mean you like overalls short alls short alls fun word to say these are just, I probably should have got these. Uh -huh. But I did. Now I have to live with it, right? These are Adidas pants. I think they're, I think they're men's. We'll see. I don't know if you, how you can tell. Does anybody know how you can tell if they're men's on Adidas? Probably just have to look up the, the number. Okay. But, ow. Just pop my wrist. I can't believe I did that. They're just regular black Adidas pants with the white stripes. Mm, they might be women's. Because they kind of flare. I don't know. 
I'll look it up. They're a little heavy though, so. Okay, okay. I really like this. Um, hi, Cindy. Really, really like this shirt. I don't, I couldn't, I, I try to comp it, but truthfully, I was just, <laughs> I don't know. I just decided to get it. I like it. It'll be good for next winter, I hope. Probably on eBay. Maybe I'll just keep it. Uh, it has like a mixed print. It has a scene on the top. With the reindeer on the back. It's Woolrich. And it's large. And I'm assuming it's wool, but I don't know. The size tag's faded. I won't assume it, but it's really cute. And heavy and warm. There's that word again, cute. Okay. I think we are on the last item. I told you guys, maybe this was not the greatest thing. Thing, but we are going to probably go back in two weeks, we decided, for longer during the week, I think. I think. So, um, this is, let me get it all figured out here. It looked well made, I didn't look it up, but I figure summer is just around the corner. So it is a bikini top or a swimsuit top, shade and sh shade and shore, and it also has the detachable or attachable detachable string on the top, and it has like a two thing, and it really like the string looks like it's never been used because it was factory tied still, but it looked like it was in really good shape. So, like I said, and it has a cute, like, stitching detail. So, yeah. That is what I got. Nothing too exciting this time. But they were, like, I really think they were dumping bins, too. Because, like, I would see some, well, I know for a fact towards the end they were. Because I saw exactly some of the same exact, like, a typewriter, a blue typewriter. That you know they uh, probably don't have two of the exact same vintage blue typewriters. Um, so I know they dumped that then at the end, towards the end they were. But, and recycling the bin, stuffing them, like, for, like, bringing them out again. Which is whatever, but... <laughs> Like I said, hopefully in next, I mean, I got some okay stuff, stuff that's kind of store filler, stuff that will make my money back for sure, but I spent on just a few items, if and when they sell, and just some other stuff to list, right? I really wish I would have checked this guy out before I bought him, though, but he's still really creepy. <laughs> Maybe he'll go up with my creepy doll. So, oh, and I think the Snoopy doll was pr pretty good, too. This guy, I think he was a pretty good find. Anyways, that's all I got for tonight. I hope everybody has a good rest of the weekend. Maybe Monday or Tuesday I'll do a working hangout or something. I really miss doing that. I like doing the working hangouts. Um, I just haven't had a chance to lately. And I've just kind of been on a... I don't know. I just haven't been feeling like going live working that much lately. But anyways, I guess I will go... I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. Sorry, it was kind of grumpy and...
crabby sounding and kind of spacey. <laughs> I was. Um, it's late. I'm tired. I'm going to go eat supper and um, just relax and start listening to all this stuff tomorrow, hopefully. So I will see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me and being here. I really appreciate it. And that's all I got to say. So bye, guys.